Well, I'm really excited because today is a very big day for the Mac. And it starts with MacBook. We have a great lineup of notebook computers called MacBook. And just a few months ago, we introduced perhaps the best we have ever created, the 15-inch MacBook Pro with a Retina display. And everyone has fallen in love with it. And Gadget wrote, the new display is gorgeous, <laughs> absolutely gorgeous. The Verge, best display ever. Walt Mossberg is throwing a hissy fit right Wired. now. He is so mad. Apple has undoubtedly created the best notebook display in the market. And they're all correct. <laughs> it is the best display housed in the best notebook design we have ever made. Bill, you charming devil. But you might not know that our number one selling notebook is actually the 13-inch MacBook Pro. In fact, it's our number one selling Mac. And customers love it because of its combination of power and small size. It's just perfect for so many uses. It truly is a great computer. So in typical Apple fashion, we're going to take our best product and we're going to introduce something so much better, so much cooler, more capable, and I'm really excited to show you for the first time the brand new 13-inch MacBook Pro. Boom, there it is, guys. Our first new hardware of the day. And it's a good one. Yeah, it's a solid. It, it is incredibly thin, just 0.75 inches thin. Let's put that side by side with the previous generation. You can see there's a huge difference. It's 20% thinner, a full one-fifth thinner. But even more impressive, it weighs just over three and a half pounds. That's almost a full pound lighter than the previous generation. It also makes it our lightest MacBook Pro ever. And here it is on the side. Look how thin that is. Beautiful thin base, thin display, and all the I.O. our Pro customers need. On the left-hand side, there's MagSafe 2, two Thunderbolt ports, a USB 3 port, headphone, and dual microphones. On the right-hand side, as with the 15-inch, we removed the optical drive, and now we have room for an SD card reader, HDMI video out, and a second USB 3 port. Here it is on the other side, equally beautiful from both sides. <laughs> Best of all, it has a retina display. That is a display where the pixels are so small that at a normal working distance, your eye can't discern them. <laughs> and everything on it looks absolutely gorgeous. It measures 13.3 inches on the diagonal. For pixels, it's an amazing 2,560 by 1,600. That is four times the number of pixels of the previous generation. And if you've done the math, I'm sure some of you have, that's 4,096,000 pixels. That makes it the world's second highest resolution notebook computer. <laughs> yes, our 15 inch is the first, but think about that. This 13 inch notebook has more pixels than any competitive 15 or even 17 inch notebook. It is amazing. Looked at another way. Many of us have HD TVs now, 1920 by 1080. And here's the new 13 inch MacBook Pro alongside it, showing the same image, but let's overlap those images. You can see the 13-inch MacBook Pro's Retina display displays almost twice as many pixels, almost two million more pixels than an HDTV. It is a so, guys, um, this has always been that whole like, oh, the well. computer is such a higher it's resolution than your TV. It always wow. has. It's always it always, a it always has. Really That's why when in the past, like 10 years ago, when you even tried to plug in your computer, you'd be like, oh, it's always has. Yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong. These displays are really nice. You're just going to have to ask yourself if they're $500 more nice or however much the premium is. Yeah, Let's, the rumored price is $1699, so we'll see. Let's go check it out. So reading email, the text is so beautiful you can't see the pixels. Surfing the web can be like a fine print magazine. Using iWork applications like Keynote, your slides look absolutely gorgeous. iLife applications are great too. When you use iMovie, the small thumbnails of video are even stunning and sharp. And spe especially pro applications like our Aperture Photo application for pros. You now have access to four million pixels for native photo resolution. There's never been 
a small notebook that gave pro photographers this kind of technology and capability. And if you're looking for more apps that all support our new retina displays, just go to our Mac App Store. You're going to find plenty more there now. There's productivity apps like Evernote and OmniGraffle. There's creative applications like Pixelmator and Sketchbook Pro, and even games like Civilization V and Real Racing 2. It's a lot of great software now to support the retina display. So that alone is an amazing new feature on the new MacBook Pro. But there's a lot more. There's a FaceTime HD camera with 720 video recording, dual microphones, Stereo so guys, for those of you who are watching along with this, uh, we're starting to hear about the specs. We have on our live poll below a poll that's asking you, is this what you've been waiting for? So while this continues on, we want you guys to vote and find out what you think about this new MacBook Pro Retina, what you've seen so far. Obviously, when the price point comes out, you'll be able to kind of make your final distinction, but we want to know what you guys think about this MacBook Pro Retina so especially, far. Especially, in fact, I'm asking my pro photographer friend who just sent me a note and said, I want a 17-inch, please. Yeah. Is a 13-inch laptop great for you as a pro photographer, like Phil just said? Probably, mm -hmm. probably no, not. I'm leaning toward no. All right, we'll go back to the stream, guys. Such a small design. Let me highlight some of the features. It's pretty incredible. You have Intel dual core, i5 or i7 Ivy Bridge processors, Intel HD graphics 4000, much faster graphics, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, standard eight gigabytes of memory, up to 768 gigabytes of flash. It's all flash-based for storage. And of course, now up to seven hours of battery life in such a thin, light product. It is a fantastic computer. And it ships with OS X Mountain Lion. And Mountain Lion has many great features that take advantage of this technology and are perfect for our notebook users. So for example, built-in voice dictation. So anywhere you can type, you can also speak. And with dual microphones, that works even better. And of course, over Wi-Fi, we have AirPlay. So if you have Apple TV hooked up to your TV set, you can Put your photos, your movies, your presentations up there for everyone to see. Documents in the cloud so you can work on your iWork documents on your MacBook Pro and access them wherever you are, on your iPad or even your iPhone. And probably the coolest feature, PowerNap. With PowerNap, while your notebook is asleep, it can automatically update your contacts, your calendar, Someone your made their email, own bed for the MacBook. Photo stream, take a nap. Download software so updates, cute. even it's back like up to a time capsule. <laughs> So this is a great new MacBook Pro. And it starts with a 2.5 gigahertz dual core i5, eight gigs of memory, and 128 gigabytes of flash for just $16.99. $16.99 was the magic number that people have been talking about. Now, well, the 15-inch MacBook Pro with Retina Display has been a big hit. And this is $500 less expensive, so customers are going to really appreciate that. And it starts shipping today. Ooh! And like all of our products, the team works very, very hard on making these environmentally friendly. So we have a 